Okay, there's the Tacoma Fish Passage Facility, trap and haul facility. So the salmon come up the river, go up a fish ladder, go into the, the facility here where they're sorted, and uh, then put into hoppers, and the hoppers drop the fish into the trucks. And then the trucks haul them three miles up the road to the above the Howard Hansen Dam, and they are released up above the Howard Hansen Dam once the fish passage facility at the dam gets built. Right here is the Tacoma's Diversion Dam. This was built in 1912, and so it stops all the upstream migration of the salmon and steelhead at this point, which is why the facility is here to trap them so they can be hauled upstream. Uh, the diversion dam is necessary to divert water into a pipe to take it to the filtration plant downriver from here just a little bit where it's cleaned and used for public drinking water for most of the South Puget Sound area. So this is the beautiful Green River and there at this point it's three miles up to the Howard Hansen Dam and above the Howard Hansen Dam is 100 miles of pristine habitat that is available for rearing and spawning of uh, the salmon that salmon are not getting past the point where we're standing right now so by getting that fish passage facility built at the Howard Hansen Dam there will be more salmon produced as a result of this project than any other project in the entire Puget Sound area this is more than the Elwha River Dam removal produced so this is why this facility is so, uh, project is so important Still got some snow pack up there, looking upstream at the Howard Hansen Dam.